Hey everyone, Josie here at Kern Laser Systems. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today, we are continuing our journey cutting the 50 states out of different materials. And we will be cutting the states that start with the letter C out of three different metals. California, Colorado, and Connecticut. We will be processing these three states with some eighth inch mild steel, some 30 thou stainless steel, and some 30 thou aluminum. And we will be processing these materials on our 500 watt CO2 laser on our OptiFlex laser system. You might notice our bed looks a little different than in the previous videos. Today, we will be using the metal cutting woodwork table. This is a more durable bread structure that holds up better when cutting thicker, mild steel especially since we will be using higher power parameters and an oxygen assist gas. All right, let's get started with California and the mild steel. We are in corral draw with our map. For metal cutting, it is best to use a lead-in for each cut part. I used our Lead-In Pro software to quickly add the lead-in to California. This allows the laser to pierce the metal away from the cut profile and ensures a seamless, clean cut. As we have done in the previous videos, we are going to click on California and hit the S. That is our selection tool to export to KCAM. It allows us to only export the parts of the file that are currently selected in the program. Now we are in KCAM and we will hit our settings button that brings us right to our vector cutting colors. Our file has a single black hairline, so in the black color, we will be going one inch per second at 70% power for eighth inch mild steel on the 500 watt OptiFlex. To cut mild steel as clean as possible, we will have to input some extra settings in the vector settings tab. Our pier start delay will be 1.3 seconds at 30% power. And we will switch our assist gas to oxygen. Set our pierce air PSI for oxygen to 30. During our cut, our air pressure PSI will be set to 80. We are set up to cut this file. Before I hit start, I'm going to make sure the height follower is on and open the valve to the oxygen tank. Let's begin. Now we are going to get started with our aluminum cut for Colorado. If you watched our video in February, you might recognize this material. This is 30 thou anodized aluminum from ChemMetal, and we just have a different color from their 900 series. Let's jump into our cut settings for aluminum. I have already sent Colorado over to KCAM. For aluminum, we will be going 0.8 inches per second at 70% power. Now we will go into our vector settings tab and change the assist gas to nitrogen and our PSI to 150. We will keep the pierce delay settings the same. Our nitrogen tank is already open and is switched in our settings so we don't need to close or open any of the tanks until we are done with all of the cuts. We are ready to start Colorado. Lastly, we have the stainless steel cut for Connecticut. Now for stainless steel, we are going to be changing our focus gap from the top of the material to the cutting head to the bottom of the material to the cutting head. 
This is to remove any slag or dross from cutting the material. Our stainless steel is 30 thou thick, so we will just move the focus down 30 thou to focus on the bottom of the material. Connecticut is a very small state, especially at the scale of the map we are cutting. To make sure our finished part doesn't fall through the table, we are going to use a tab. This 10 thou gap in between the start and finish will keep the part connected to the material just barely enough so when we are finished, we can break it off and not lose it in between the grid work. We also have our lead-in extending up the beginning line of the cut. I will click on Connecticut and send it over using our selection export tool. Now we will optimize our settings in KCAM. Our settings for cutting the stainless steel will be one inch per second at 28% power. Our cis gas is still nitrogen, but we will be changing the PSI to 200. Our pierce is 0.4 seconds at 30% power with a PSI of 200. You could cut stainless steel with shop air or oxygen, but nitrogen gives the smoothest edge, so we will continue with nitrogen as our assist gas. We are set for this part. Thank you for watching today's video. We will be continuing the 50 State series next month, so be sure to comment down below what materials you want to see us cut. Make sure to like and subscribe to stay up to date with all things Kern Lasers, and we will see you in the next video.